Could robots like these spell the end of traditional live firearms training? One company argues that static targets don't prepare troops for what's to come on the battlefield. This is their alternative. The robots here have a specific mission, and that is we are trying to solve a problem that all militaries have, which is the only time they do live fire training with realistic moving targets, the only time they practice the skill is in combat, which is a very bad place for on-the-job training. So soldiers uh, shoot at stationary targets, uh, just like they did in uh, Wellington's time, and then they go into combat and everything is moving around very quickly and they can lock up and freeze. So get that training before, not after. This autonomous robotic training system is being embraced by the US Marine Corps, the Australian Army and is being used to train new recruits in Ukraine. Using AI, the armoured robots move and behave like people. If one is shot, the others either scatter for cover or self-organise a swarming autonomous attack. One of the dynamics that we have seen again and again is the most, exper most experienced shooters will struggle with this at first because uh, they can hit 99 out of 100 static targets all day, but when it's moving and you have civilians, c civilian robots in the mix, it gets very complex. The UK is apparently interested in the system which it's claimed has tripled the lethality of US Marine Corps users in just one day. Claire Sadler, Forces News, iTech, Rotterdam. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.